Hey guys, got another one for you today. And today I'm back in my Panzer 7. When I say today, it's like five minutes past the last video I just made. Um, so we had two, the platoon mates step out. It's just me and Beholden. He's in his T-57 Heavy and I'm back in my Panzer 7. We are on Pearl River Standard Battle. Uh, it's half, half, tier 10, tier 9s. And our heavy tanks are making the right push, getting up in the nine line. Their scouts push middle, um, and they're 13105. I make him pay as he comes over. We had a nice crew in here. Uh, he's got both gun perks, so uh, accuracy on the move with, in a German is is pretty solid. Not to say that you're going to make all those shots, but definitely more than you would in like a Soviet or Chinese, British. Seems like this meta on this map, since it came back, really changed to like southwest corner and middle. Um, and not a lot of guys go up here. However, in this match, uh, I was back to the old school meta and we're gonna have a nice fist fight up here. So we got T10 right here. He shoots my track. I never know if they actually, do they want to track me in this tank or do they just miss? And I think he actually wanted to track me because he had a lot of tanks behind him that we didn't have spotted yet. So I get my second shell in him, we take him down. And you see they got Death Star, STI, uh, T-30, Type 4 Heavy, T-10, and uh, WZ-120 up here. And I fluffed my shot there. Um, I started backing up before I shot. I was just trying to make that a timing shot, watching my reload speed. So that was my bad, playing like a noob. And T30 puts one in my lower plate. I return the favor by putting one in his upper plate. Pretty surprised um, at this angle he could pen me. However, it only rolled like 300, so he might be just shooting HE. Shooting down into the top of his turret and I bounce that shell, that was pretty frustrating. Um, Beholden tells me that we have guys coming in behind us, so I let him know that I'm focused over there. They're not really pushing on Conqueror back here, so hopefully that Conqueror can hold. And I'm just gonna cross here. It's risky, but at this point I know my Conqueror is gonna fall, so I wanna be with my platoon mate when we need to push this out. He gets that Conqueror tracked and he ammo racks him. And now at this point I'm just gonna start pushing. And behold, it makes that call as well. It says that we just need to push out that flank. Conqueror is still holding strong over there. Their T30 takes our E4 out. Death Star finally takes our Conqueror out. And now they're going to fold it in behind us. So we definitely got to keep this moving. And I blocked Beholden Shell. Um, mostly just because I had to get my gun down on that Conqueror. And now this STI is shooting HE at me. And if we can push over here, we can use the hills to get hull down and corners and stuff. And I'm gonna toss this little STI like a rag doll back up, get his rear. At this point, I'm trying to be meat shield while Beholden uh, reloads. Let him get the damage out when he can. Tried to track that 120, but I missed. And he just scoots by me. If I get a side scraping uh, ram there, I feel like I can damage him. And then I bounce off the STB. Or is that STB? I'm sorry. It's, a, it's definitely not STB, it's T10. And I should have prioritized my enemies better. I'll switch over to Beholden real quick. fighting a type 4 now and you can see our our uh, 
four tanks turned to two really quickly. Um, however, since we pushed that out, we isolated some of their tanks and got some extra damage. Now Beholden's on 200 damage and he's got a T10 behind him. All this T10 has to do is take time, take his time and make sure he kills him. Um, however, he only tracks Beholden, so Beholden gets his, uh, his clip in and he just about takes that T10 down, leaves him on 185. And we really set our team up there to be able to finish this out. So it's 12-9. Uh, I've definitely seen some green teams throw this, but it's going to be pretty tough at this point. Nice thing is, is our scout put cap pressure on, so it forces their hand to come back to the base if they want to win. Our chieftain shuts that guy down. Did 4,800 damage, block 2,000, and Beholden definitely carried this game. Uh, 6,400, 11,000 between the two of us, four kills. Um, maybe could have got some more kills in there to keep us alive, um, but you can't complain about 11,000 damage from two tanks. So we definitely put our team in position to win there, and they shut it down, um, made sure we got left with the victory. So. Panzer 7, great all-rounder. Um, maybe mobility is a little lacking, but the armor makes up for it. A lot of people just don't know what to do when this thing comes at them, and its alpha damage punishes people um, and can help it trade effectively. That's really all I got for you guys. Make sure you like, share, subscribe, and I will catch you in the next video.